of BGP Nagaland stand here to declare that today the BGP Nagaland is organizing this dharna, the peaceful and peaceful dharna, to protest and show our strong resentment and condemnation against the evil practices, the evil, the evil corruption practices being executed by the Congress in the recent case. Particularly, the case regarding the Jharkhand Congress uh, Rajya Sabha MP, Mr. Diraj Sahu, where the income tax department had raided his residence and uh, uncovered a staged money amount of 300 crores. Now this morning it has come to 353 crores and still counting. We have seen in the past that the Congress and its alliance partners have been chastising and accusing the Modi government of practicing corruption. But now the truth is out in the open. We have come to know and the truth is laid bar who is corrupt and who is not. The BGP Naglen stand here to show our strong protest and condemnation against the Congress and its alliance. Why the Congress are notably silent in this case? That is a very big question. Now, I shall give time to our chief spokesperson of BJP Nagaland, Mr. Thomas Mack, to address the issue. Dear citizens, corruption is the greatest enemy of our nation. Corruption is against humanity and corruption is against every religion. That is why our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi has called all of us to be responsible and declare the government to be a corrupted free government. We are all responsible with a glaring call from the, our Prime Minister to be responsible towards the nation building. It is our duty to voice against the corruption that is going on in our country. His call to be sub kasat, sub kabikas, sub kabishwas, and sub ka that is the call of the citizen to be responsible for all that is all that corruption that is happening in our country the call of our prime minister to the citizens to the responsible citizens those who have been enjoying the unentitled especially the gas subsidy with his call, the citizens, 10 million citizens responded and gave up the subsidy. Is it not? The building of the nation, dear citizen, whatever is going on now, especially this very moment, we have gathered to protest against the Rajya Sapa MP Tiraj Sahu, where the cash of rupees 350 plus above, still the counting is going on. It is the duty of each and every citizen to raise our voice against the, con the corrupted Congress leader. It is not the interest of the BJP to make a false propaganda against any individual or any political party. However, it is the duty of all of us and BJP to speak the truth, to voice out the truth. At this crucial juncture, it is the duty of all of us to raise our voice against the menace of corruption that is going on in our country. We are all equally responsible 
the nation is ours, whether small or big, we all belong to the same family. And it is the duty of all of us to be responsible in raising our voice against the corruption. And I request the people, the nation, the public of this nation to raise their voice against this corruption which is brought to daylight. We appeal on behalf of the BJP Nagaland, appeal the responsible citizens to voice our voice together to eliminate corruption in our country. So, okay. Thanks, dear sir. Achanak holi bhi. Horup, usoda ajibhi horup. Achanak holi bhi. Amiga nidu, dharana guru de matadu. BJP lovers, party workers, ki mana se. So, bahadu. So, okay, thanks, dear sir. Amiga nidu, sab jane ase. Amiga nidu, chief, chief spokesperson. Amiga nidu, media. Ki koi se, amiga nidu, sab huni se. Congress stands for Corruption. Congress party, what is it? Now, what is it? What is it, Congress party? Congress has made the country's government. But the government is doing the government and the government is doing the government. Hey, Amigan Congress MP, Dhiraj Sahula Gode, 351 crore. Dhoradu. This is all the money. All the money. Amigan, this is not intolerable, not intolerable to anybody. Amigan, we strongly appeal to the government to take action on Diraj Sahu. Amigan, this is not intolerable to anybody. Amigan, this is not intolerable to anybody. Rahul Gandhi, Congress President, Kharge, this is not intolerable to anybody. This is my BJP Nagaland, this is the Hudhiwa Mona, इतु पैसा दिरा साहूला घोड़े धोरा तो कांग्रेस ला पैसा आसे ना राहुल गांधी ला आसे ना सोनिया गांधी ला आसे ना कांग्रेस प्रेसिडेंट खरगे ला आसे अमिगान कौन चना अमिला स्पोक्स पर्सन भी इतु कोई ना से प्राइम मिनिस्टर मोदी 15 इयर्स आसे ने यू हैव सीन इन द प्रीवियस इलेक्शन इधे that election team that they kill a GTC because we have delivered Prime Minister Modi has delivered to the people Congress Paki Tise Alu Chamrabi Dhe Nai Ki Paisa Apni Gan Kovdo Ki Paisa Kupa Nai Ami Gan Mili Gana Itu Corruption Tu Hatai Di Wola Ghe Ami Gan So Mili Gana And we will not race till the action is taken against Congress till the action is taken against Thank you. Good afternoon, friends. As I am here on the party's behalf, I will just bring simple thing in the mind of the public. That a Lok Sabha MP is elected by the people with his popularity, but a Rajya Sabha MP, a Rajya Sabha MP is elected by a political party basing on his intellectual skills, basing on his responsibility towards the society and the party scrutinizes the member first very thoroughly and then they put him into Rajya Sabha as member of parliament to decide for the country, 140 crore people. And here the Congress party has scrutinized and found this Dheeraj Sahu to be their MP Rajya Sabha. And the one who is claiming that since last 40 years, he is into liquor business, this is his family business and he is having this kind of money for the last 40 years. So what Congress has scrutinized what Congress has found good in him is clear now that they found him with this kind of money and that is why and this is only the tip of the iceberg that it is found only in his house 350 plus crores and then three packs of ornaments and this is only cash available in his house and remaining what is there behind it and how and why has he been nominated and elected as Rajya Sabha MP by Congress. Congress should answer to the people. Today, the Bharti Janta Party has been working on all the work. And the reason why we have been working here is the reason for corruption. 
बार बार आप लोग टीवी चैनल पे कांग्रेस का प्रवक्ता जब बोलता है तो एक ही बात बोलता है ईडी ईडी सीबीआई बीरो ऐसा डराया जाता है अब डराते हैं या सच का ऐसा है ये जनता को पता चलना चाहिए आप कार्यकर्ताओं के माध्यम से कि ये जो 350 करोड़ 351 करोड़ रुपया प्लस अभी जो काउंटिंग काउंटिंग जारू है तो आपको पता करना चाहिए उसके कांग्रेस के प्रवक्ता से लीडर से पूछना चाहिए कि जो आप टीवी पर गला फार फार के चिल्लाते हैं कि हम ईडी के नाम लेते हैं बाकी चीज़ों का नाम लेते हैं सीबीआई का नाम लेते हैं पैसा ये किसका है दूसरा अभी तत्काल में तुरंत छत्तीसगढ़ में चुनाव होता है और पाँच करोड़ रुपया का दावा ठोका जाता है महादेव ऐप के नाम से और उसका परिणाम हम देखते हैं कि छत्तीसगढ़ की जो सरकार है वो कांग्रेस के हाथ से चली जाती है जनता करप्शन को बर्दाश्त नहीं करती कांग्रेस के लीडर गला फार फार के चिल्लाते हैं सबको कहते हैं पंद्रह लाख कहाँ मिला मोदी जी का अरे आप छोड़ेगा तब तो हम पंद्रह लाख देगा ना जितने आपके तिजोरी में आपके अलमारी में पैसा बंद है वो पैसा मुझे वापस मिल जाए तभी तो हम पंद्रह लाख बांट पाएंगे और उसका प्रयास चल रहा है कि अगर आप किसी भी तय खाने पर पैसा रखे हैं तो मोदी जी की सरकार ईमानदार सरकार आज हम उस पैसा को जमीन से खोद कर निकाल के और जनता के विकास में लगाने का काम करें Mr. Dhiraj Sahu. 
under the leadership of our honorable state president, the protest was a grand success, as you can see from the number of crowd. It is not only the BJP Karyakarta, but people from all walks of life have came here and attended, collaborated with the protest. Now, as a concluding remark, Congress party, in the DNA of Congress party, corruption is there, which has been showing time and again. And this is also one of the instances where the DNA of Congress party has been exposed, that is corruption. Even in the dictionary of English, the word Congress can be replaced by corruption and case. No wonder Congress party is losing election one after the other. The reason is very simple. The people of India has denied the cash. The people of India deny corruption. But the people of India wants development and progress, which is delivered by our Honorable Narendra Modi and his government. So we are once again very hopeful that in the upcoming 2024 election, BJP will come once again to the power with larger majority and take India forward. Thank you. Jai Hind. Woo!